What's something people don't know about Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.? It's because of his dream. A dream of a world where equality reigns. A world where love conquers hate. Dr. King's journey shows us that change is possible. It shows us that ordinary people can achieve extraordinary things. Dr. King wasn't born a hero. He was a man who faced fear and doubt. He wrestled with the immense responsibility thrust upon him. But he found strength in his faith and in the teachings of another great leader, Mahatma Gandhi. This is going to blow your mind. Dr. King was deeply inspired by Gandhi's philosophy of nonviolence. This philosophy, rooted in ancient traditions, emphasized the power of peaceful protest and civil disobedience. Gandhi, who led India to independence, showed the world the power of peaceful resistance. His methods were revolutionary, proving that one could fight injustice without resorting to violence. He proved that love could be a weapon against oppression. Gandhi's approach was not just about political strategy. It was a moral stance, a way of life that demanded immense courage and discipline. Dr. King, facing the brutality of segregation in America, saw in Gandhi a path forward. The harsh realities of racial discrimination and violence in the United States required a powerful yet peaceful response. He traveled to India, seeking guidance and inspiration. This journey was more than a physical trip. It was a quest for deeper understanding and spiritual growth. He wanted to understand the depths of Gandhi's teachings. Dr. King immersed himself in the principles of nonviolence, learning from those who had walked the path before him. He wanted to learn how to apply them to the struggle for civil rights. The lessons he learned in India became the cornerstone of his own movement back home. This journey was a turning point for Dr. King. It transformed his approach to activism, reinforcing his commitment to nonviolence. It solidified his belief in nonviolence as the only way to achieve true and lasting change. Dr. King's dedication to these principles left an indelible mark on the civil rights movement and continues to inspire generations. You need to watch this if you struggle with understanding your own strength. One story that deeply resonated with Dr. King came from Arun Gandhi, Mahatma Gandhi's grandson. This story is a powerful lesson about inner strength and understanding our own capabilities. Arun spoke of a time when he was a boy living in his grandfather's ashram. The ashram was a place of learning, discipline, and self-discovery. Arun was frustrated because he wasn't as strong as the other boys. He felt inadequate and often compared himself to others, which only deepened his frustration. He complained to his grandfather, who gave him a simple task. Gandhi's tasks were never just chores. They were lessons in disguise. Gandhi told Arun to go find all the strong people in the village and write down their names. Arun took this task seriously and set out to identify the strongest individuals he could find. Arun returned, list in hand, feeling proud. He had found many strong people and felt a sense of accomplishment. Gandhi then told him to find all the weak people and write down their names. This task puzzled Arun, as it seemed much more difficult and subjective. Confused, Arun argued that he couldn't do that, that it wasn't right. He felt it was unfair to label people as weak. Gandhi smiled and said, That is the point. We can only make ourselves strong. We cannot make others weak. This profound lesson taught Aaron that true strength comes from within, and that we should focus on our own growth rather than comparing ourselves to others. I bet you didn't know how the power of love can transform entire movements. This story, shared by Gandhi's grandson, illuminated the essence of nonviolent resistance. It was a powerful reminder of how peaceful actions can lead to profound change, even in the face of great adversity. Gandhi's teachings have inspired countless individuals to choose the path of peace over violence. It's about understanding that true strength lies in love and compassion, not in force or domination. When we act out of love, we build bridges and create connections that can withstand the test of time. Compassion allows us to see the humanity in others, fostering a sense of unity and shared purpose. Dr. King embodied this philosophy. His life and work were a testament to the power of nonviolence and the impact it can have on society. He showed us that change is possible when we stand firm in our beliefs and act with integrity. He famously said, Darkness cannot drive out darkness. Only light can do that. This profound statement reminds us that negativity and hatred can only be overcome by positivity and love. Hate cannot drive out hate. Only love can do that. 
Love is the most powerful force we have, capable of transforming hearts and minds. He also said, we must develop and maintain the capacity to forgive. Forgiveness is not just an act, but a continuous practice that helps us heal and move forward. He who is devoid of the power to forgive is devoid of the power to love. Without forgiveness, love cannot flourish, and without love, we cannot truly connect with one another. These words weren't just rhetoric. They were a guiding principle for living a life of purpose and meaning. They were a call to action, a blueprint for a better world. By embracing these ideals, what's your next step towards greatness? And love Share your thoughts in the comments future. below, and let's inspire each other to reach new heights. Until next time, keep striving, keep growing, and keep believing in the power of your dreams.